You know, I want to learn about the Bible. It's just so conservative. It's not. What? The Bible, it's not inherently conservative. Really? Yeah, there's some parts that are more conservative and some parts that are more progressive. There's progressive parts of the Bible? Oh yeah, lots. Name one. Proverbs 14.31. Those who oppress the poor insult their maker, but those who are kind to the needy honor him. Well, that's a one-off. Proverbs 13.23. The field of the poor may yield much food, but it is swept away through injustice. These are both bonus passages. I was actually just looking for Proverbs 22.22 and stumbled upon these. But that's not Jesus. Jesus is conservative, I thought. Absolutely not. <laughs> what do you mean? Can I give you some examples? Sure, but only if they're from what I'm reading right now, which is Luke chapter 9. Okay. In Luke 9, 10 through 17, Jesus gives food to 5,000 people without requiring anything of them. A massive handout. No work requirements, no confession of Christ as Lord. Nothing. Another one. In Luke 9, 37 through 43, Jesus provides free health care to a boy who has a demon. In fact, the common theology of the time was that demon possession or illness was caused by the sin of the person or their parents. Jesus rejects this in John 9, 1 through 3. Another one. That... In Luke 9, 46 through 48, the disciples argue about who is greatest, and Jesus puts a child in front of them. Somebody who has no wealth, no status, no b Well, you get the joke. This, this child is the lowest in society, and Jesus lifts them up as a person that they should idolize. He inverts the power pyramid that conservative religion is built upon. Another one. In Luke 9, 51 through 56, Jesus goes to a Samaritan village and is rejected. His disciples want him to call down fire upon the village, and Jesus rebukes the disciples. Jesus rejected using violence against people with different religious beliefs, something that conservative Christians refuse to recognize. Wow, is the whole Bible like this? Yes, the whole Bible is like this. <laughs> Who would even teach about the Bible from a progressive perspective? Well, I do have a Bible study that I'm launching. Well, how would I sign up? If you're interested, there's a button on my website where you can sign up. I'm asking folks to support it through my Patreon, which is $8 a month. If you can't afford that or if you're a student, just sign up and let me know and I'd be happy to let you in for free. Huh.